motivate for your dose of faith and life-based motivation. <sighs> it's been about two weeks since I have posted a video and that's not on purpose. I just feel like maybe it's time for me to quit this YouTube journey because honestly there are so many other things in my life that requires my attention, most importantly being a mother and a wife. And also, I work from home online, so that commands my attention as well because sometimes I have a high workload which requires me to pay more attention to getting tasks done within a specific time frame. And I'm going to be honest, YouTube is a lot of work. It's a lot of work. You have to find somewhere nicely, film the videos, and then you have to sit and edit because they say that content is king. But I'm going to add that quality is also king. Or maybe quality is the queen. Yeah, I think quality is the queen. I would say that. So for me, it's a challenge to find somewhere to record that has adequate lighting and that is good when it comes on to sound and sometimes I really don't feel like making videos because I feel like I have to put on too much like I have to fix up myself and come on camera I have to look a particular way I have to keep saying like comment share subscribe and then I have to go through the process of sharing the link to the video to persons in my whatsapp contact or on my Facebook and Instagram pages but um, I have a lot to say in terms of quality content but I struggle with making quality videos because to be honest I think the best video that I've made thus far in terms of quality was my introductory video to my YouTube channel that was the best in my opinion as it relates to quality all the other videos I start out well in terms of how I sound the quality of the sound and then it drops or the video is dark and that affects the visibility of viewers who are watching the videos I don't have a lot of views on my videos and I don't blame people for not watching them through because the quality is dirt but the content is golden so I just believe that um, YouTube may not be for me so I may just have to quit this YouTube journey I will however continue to post inspirational content on my Facebook and Instagram pages so you can connect with me on Instagram and Facebook at Nikisha Low Motivate for more inspirational content but YouTube is a lot of work as I said before and you have to put a lot of thought into it in terms of how you want your video to come out what you want people to get from the content that you are sharing you have to have adequate lighting in some instances you may require a mic and you know for some persons they may not be able to afford those things right now or they may not be able to access them even if it is that they have the money for different reasons and of course in these challenging times you have to be smart about how you're spending money especially if the goal is not to monetize the channel the channel eventually so i don't know it's i just don't i just don't think it's for me and i'm trying to be consistent when i just started i said that i would have been posting videos every saturday or sunday and for a while i was on i was i was on point i was posting regularly as as i said i would and then this happened two weeks later here's the other video and i don't know if and when there will be another video after this but it's something that i'm thinking about but i have topics written down for videos that i wanted to do i'll probably still do those videos but just post them on a different platform because I feel as though this is a lot of work because when you film the video you have to go through to edit and editing takes a lot of time especially if you're not that keen on the software that you're using and if you're not that tech savvy it can come out looking tacky as you will be able to see if you choose to go back and watch some of my videos so like for this video I'm not even going to edit it like just care but it takes a lot of time and when I am 
recording sometimes the recording does not go as planned sometimes the sun gone in and then it, the video get dark sometimes I start out excited and happy and then as soon as I put the camera on myself attached to the tripod use with the use of my smartphone it's like my dust go I don't know it's like me crawl up in a one shell and then I just I don't know I withdraw somewhat from what I wanted to say so then the energy and the the, the, the vibes the mother want to bring it's not there eh? <laughs> so I think in my last video I was talking about goals and I was making the analogy to box braids and like that was a good analogy a good analogy like the content was good but the quality of the video itself was poor the lighting was crappy and then at some points in the video you could hardly hear what I was saying so my granny even asked me say um, well she said to me say <laughs> yes may I mix up a toy in my video don't say no <laughs> so she even said to me say every minute yeah 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 record video and nothing yeah, yeah get paid for it it's not a matter of me getting paid it's a it's a matter of me positively impacting my space i want to positively impact my space i want to help others along this journey cause um called life because life in and of itself it had some my time you know it had some my time and sometimes we just need that little push to continue just to be reminded that you know there's hope and then that somebody else out there go through the same thing where you are go through or they have gone through it and they were able to survive and the possibility of you actually surviving is a reality or it can be a reality for you so that's the purpose of what I do I call it a ministry Mikisha Lo motivates so hold on so I said I would not be editing this video but I'm going to have to edit it to include this clip because I accidentally clicked on stop instead of pause so I may have to go edit it and drop in the part here but it will not be that intense editing because honestly girl girl have other things to do I'm a new mother and my daughter is getting older so she requires more of my time now she's up and about well not really up and about she's seven plus months now so she's almost eight months so I have to be very intentional about paying attention to her trying to stimulate her um, in different ways that I can to help her to develop cognitively as she should and yeah that take time and some days I really just don't have the time to record and post videos and I know for those 83 persons who subscribe to this channel thank you so much for your subscriptions thank you for believing in what I had to say and what I had to share enough to subscribe to the channel and even if that's not the reason why you subscribe because you, you really was just interested in what I have to say and all of them someday thank you so much I really appreciate it and I don't think it's fair for me to have you guys there and like there's just you know activity on the channel and I just wanted to come and do this quick update that that's really where my thought process is now whether or not YouTube is for me and I'm really contemplating YouTube because it requires a lot it requires a lot and any YouTube content creator will who is honest enough will tell you that YouTube is a lot of work like when you think about how you want your videos to come out and then you record it and then you sit down and say all right I'm going to edit it and I'm going to insert this and insert that like you really want a particular feel from your videos when you put them out so that that can be echoed in when persons watch it and you get the feedback and yeah you have to visualize what you want it to look like so it can come together you can't just get up with a camera well you could because some people are that creative they get up with a camera out of the blues and then record something and it's a hit it go viral and it works for them but not everybody mind minds work like that some of you really have to sit down and think about it and then write it down and then schedule our time as to when we're going to record when we're going to post and in the beginning i was very enthusiastic about starting this channel and sharing what i had to say and what the lord has done for me and how he has delivered me from different things and like i said i will still do that probably just on a different platform so like yeah if you're a new youtuber 
kudos to you like stay committed if you have the time right now where most of us are in quarantine then do it start your channel start your channel make sure you produce um, quality content that will add value to the lives of other people but just know that when you hit a roadblock which more than likely will come make sure say you have something offset the roadblock they are free mash up the roadblock they are to provide or do something to it to get it out of your way so you can continue to move forward but yeah i think this was necessary i think um this is me venting really and you have the youtube world 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 is <laughs> so saturated you know so you have to niche down and find an area that you know that you will be most effective in in terms of adding value and an area where you're most knowledgeable in whether it is lifestyle uh motivation faith uh cooking um techie stuff uh beauty fashion do-it-yourself uh, projects and parenting relationships and all of them good someday like you just have to find somewhere that suits you where you fit in and just add value to it and always be yourself always be yourself and just allow your personality to shine through shine through <laughs> shine through for me whenever i put my phone on that tripod i become a recluse i'm an ambivert i love people i have moments where i'm just out and about i'm bubbly happy excited one bear on people and then one next time i just want to by myself in my own space with my own thoughts and just feel but whenever that that the phone goes on the tripod i think that i become shy but even from university you know i studied mass communication at northern Kaiman university with an emphasis in public relations there's a reason why i'm never going to tv because yeah me get shy or somebody tell myself when the camera comes on and i remember i had this debating class debate and argumentation and like yeah me did a bad debater from high school and me did a go on good until the camera came on and like I mean, I know it's like all of my thoughts them they run out they run out they run out and left my head and we just turn up the day i look <laughs> and then i saw it being replayed on uh the university's tv station one time i'm gonna look funny i'm gonna shake my head i'm gonna say you know all i'm gonna say is i thank you and that was it and usually i'll be a chatterbox as and but as soon as i go in front of people depending on the mindset that i'm in and the crowd that i'm in front of i get nervous and probably start jumble up my words if i'm not in a mindset where i have clearly thought about um what i'm going to say and how i want it to come out so yeah quitting youtube should i quit youtube do you guys think that i should quit do you have any tips or comments or suggestions that you want to leave with me that will help me along the way let me know in the comment section and i don't want to say like comment share and subscribe because i really don't know what happened after this video but i'm going to leave it up and see what happens let me know what your thoughts are and i'm doing this video now i'm very comfortable this is me this is nikisha this is who i am sometime but yeah <laughs> this is the essence of my personality so let me know let me know let me know if you're a youtuber comment and tell me down below what kind of challenges you've had since you started your youtube journey and i must say a big 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 up to tara buckley or tara welch buckley she has been there from day one when i just started doing videos at nco she was the one who first recorded that video and it's on facebook on my facebook page nikisha Lowe. and like that video had like two point something k views like yeah so i know that people are being impacted positively by what i have to say by my videos and i love that so even if me don't get no bag of likes once you are being positively impacted by the content that i'm sharing i'm all for it consistency though it a beat me bad because a lot of times i have other things i do as we said before and if i have a lot going on i will not be able to post as consistently as i would want to 
so that might be a challenge for some people who are more accustomed to stability in a sense we don't have that right now in terms of being available to all this post every week every week so it is a double recording so like if today may have a whole heap of time we can go ahead and record like one one or two videos but that's not always the case because you know if baby wake up i forgot to baby may get hungry baby get hungry baby requires my attention so yeah let me know let me know let me know messed up ramble now so y'all take care of yourselves big up bless up and yeah